Good morning. Hi, it's Linda here and today we're going to look at Psalm 53. And the first verse in Psalm 53 is one that many people know. It says, the fool says in his heart there is no God. David the king is lamenting and mourning that people have actually forgotten that God exists or don't believe that he exists and don't cry out to God anymore. This could well have been written for today, but there's been a shift since the beginning of the COVID-19 crisis. In a recent survey done by Tearfine, results showed that people are watching services more than ever. One third of young adults and one in five of those over 55. And one in five of those watching the services say they have never interacted with church before. People are praying, calling out to God. Over half the adults in the UK have been praying. The truth is that people cry out to God in crisis, even when they are unsure whether he exists. David says only fools deny his existence, therefore it is wise to cry out, however much you doubt, because if God is there, he will hear you. Verse 2 says that God looks down from heaven upon the children of men to see if there are any who understand, who seek God. God is looking down from heaven to see if anyone is looking for him. He's looking for us. He's looking for those of us who will look to him, who will be wise and seek him. David says that no one is good and cries out for deliverance, believing it will come from Zion. A future rescue will come from Jerusalem. For Christians, that deliverance is from Jesus, who rescues us from the captivity of sin and gives us freedom and joy. Cry out to God today. He is looking for you. He has shown us he loves us through the gift of his son, Jesus, our rescuer. He wants to rescue you. He wants to give you peace. He wants to give you joy in the midst of the storm. And he wants to be your strength. So, Father God, we cry out to you today. Be our rescuer. Be with us in this storm. Help us to see you and to know you and to hear you. We thank you that you hear us. Amen.